Frank Sinatra is such a tremendous artist that you don't really need a special occasion to celebrate the man, as far as I'm concerned. Having said that two years ago, when I knew the centennial of his birth was on the horizon, I began working on this book, Sinatra, The Photographs, that I envisioned as being the ultimate photographic celebration of the 20th century's greatest vocalist. Working at the photo agency MPTV Images, one of the premier entertainment archives, I had full access to what is arguably the largest repository of Frank Sinatra imagery. Uh, the archive was founded by Sid Avery, who famously shot Sinatra during all his Capitol sessions. And they represent men such as Bob Willoughby, Ed Thrasher, Ted Allen, Bernie Abramson, all men that uh, had a wonderful rapport with Frank Sinatra and who were granted access to rehearsal halls and recording studios and movie sets and were able to capture what I consider some of the greatest images of the man. When it came to the text for the book, I wanted to make sure it had great authenticity and weight. And I thought, who better to put their handprint on the book than his wife and companion of over 20 years, Barbara Sinatra. And with her foreword and her introductions to many of Sinatra's colleagues and friends, I was able to interview people like Quincy Jones, uh, Robert Wagner and Jill St. John, Don Rickles, Dina Martin, George Slaughter. Those interviews and their stories and anecdotes, they really illuminate the photos in the book and bring them to life.